Hello, hello, everybody. Welcome back. I keep trying to jump because I, I, I feel that's a thing. And we are here. Ooh. Poked a button. Poked a button. Another button to poke. Yay! That does not sound good. Um. Chitanya Vesilo. Why is this place so stupid? Nothing works. <laughs> Idiot American machines. Well done, idiot. Breaking it will help. Stupid. You don't tell me. Take that dumb PC if you can fix it. Okay. Oh, I need a uh, step ladder. Well, where do I get a step ladder? Is there one around here? I need to find a step ladder. Oh, I bet I that opened up the, the that other area down here. <sighs> Let us see. Oh, that area is blocked off. Yes, it did. Oh, this is where I was. So I have to go back up? Yeah, I have to go back up. Alright. This is very confusing. Um, I am very lost. That is that. That is not open. This is not good. Too many toys. Children should play with rocks to help them understand life. Okay. Kind of a jerk. Stupid bear. Let me ask you. All right. Let it stay here while you do your stupid things, idiot. Um. Is there anything yet? It's dark and scary. How do I get to these areas? I want to get there. I don't think this is the right way to go. <laughs> uh, not the right way to go. Hmm. Have you seen a step ladder, Vladdy? Ah, idiot! So you are done being stupid up there. Good. Where we go? Find a step ladder. That's that area.
There are too many containers in here. Bloody does not like it. Oh, quiet, quiet. Nobody asked you. you where he is from. Vladdy is from small box. Very dark. That stupid idiot brought him out the box and it was sad. Now we are here. Completely lazy mystery. Okay. After an unexpected hit, the mind Arthur was forced to write a sequel. This time he saved everyone the trouble of reading the book altogether and revealed the killer on the back flap. The novel actually chronicles the struggle to return a pair of defective pants. Bob, I don't care how good a deal you got. No more lobbies, idiot. Gordon. Um, ooh, copy maker. Booze. Red marker. My god, Bob, what is this? There is no way in any conceivable universe that we can turn this facility into a resort. Stop it, you dummy. Quickly. Okay. A very slick looking proposal to rework the facility into a high end theme car park and casino resort. So that's a pleasing looking graph pointing upwards, so you know for sure that's a good idea. Some notable attractions include Vatland, Genetic Kingdom, and Kitchen. Okay. This is where that crazy horn was. Hiya, Ted. So you're so worried about security. I did you a favor and beefed up the doors to your room. You're absolutely welcome. Bob. Bob, you jerk. I can't even get into my room because of these stupid discount security men. Fix it. I'm sick of sleeping in the grotto. Clearly. Okay, we're making progress now. Take so many useless things, idiot. Don't judge me. I made you, didn't I? Giving up on the corn's ability to be weaponized on any level, the scientists attempted to see if they could be of any use in the general workplace. They weren't opting to take naps instead. However, the corn did display a fondness for stacking orange boxes, which they did so every chance they could. The goal of which seeming to be direct the research to what they wanted. So Bob, what do you think of this? See what you have driven me to, jerk Corley Ted. Hiya Ted, this is great. Really excited to see you get in the spirit of things. Added one of my 
so we could be side by side really think it balances the space um, holy crap Ah, fake plant. Nope. Um, well. This is uh, interesting, Indy. Bob's journal. Written entirely in red pen, it's in so much a journal as it is a mindscape with occasional pictures. Massive ambitious plans are written down and abandoned midway through inception. And sometimes mid-sentence. A box of monkey trees. There's a small navigation. There's an old chart with a very peculiar course. Plotted from United States to an island in the middle of the ocean, the course has more come with the movement of a small fly than any nautical vesicle. It's apparently part of Operation Subquanium Evader, but only owing to your poor understanding of all languages, I think that it's a chain restaurant specialized in and requires ah in Italian cuisine. Bob mistakenly thought that capuchin was another word for delicacy and ordered a thousand boxes of snack on when he was told that the snacks were in fact for monkeys. He ate them anyway. Alright. Well, this is going well. I, I feel dirty. All right, I need to find a round, probably a bowling ball of some sort. Um, oh, some lag. Put the English muffin here. I'm sure I'm gonna draw a face on something. Oh. Let us. Uh, how do I get. Where's the kitchen to the left? I took everything out of this area. How do I get into the kitchen area? Can be open from the kitchen. Uh, I don't see a way in. No vents. That vent I saw. Where's that other crazy corn guy? Should I be worried? Okay, I guess I'm trapped down here. Till I find all the pieces. No. Oh. Bob, you stupid dummy, why you commissioned that artist to make these maps is beyond me. They are unreadable. Everyone is getting lost down here. Dead. Oh, that
that's where I've been. I need to find two items of plant thingamajig. Oh, there's space down there. Really? Oh, stairs. I'm an idiot. I don't even see these stairs back here. Master plan. Appears to be the only thing Fernando, the founder's assistant, put any effort into aside from shredding important documents and wearing fancy fedoras and gloves. A very poor plan involving jumper cables, a strange lightning rod, and some how turning into an all-powerful god. No tree stupid corn told me their secret and Bob and Ted will be my assistants now. Daily Planner. The final page consists of six appointments. 9 a.m. do nothing. 11 a.m. pick up new fedora and glove. Noon torture stupid corn for amusement. 3 p.m. hide to avoid work. 545 torture corn. 6 p.m. initiate master plan. Hiya, Fernando. Could you be a pal and place our the tour brochures across the facility? There's only a few hundred, so you'll be able to do that in no time flat. Wow. Fernando, you cretin, ignore that idiot Bob's request. What are you really need to do is sort the samples in the genetics lab from le least reactive to most, so go do it, Corlita. Hey, Fernando, we've got a more important job for you than need. need the statue directly above you moved about an inch or so. Scaffolding's already set up, so you'll finish in about an hour or so. Thanks. Fernando, you lazy wolf, don't touch that statue. We don't need yet another insurance claim. Instead, go to the second floor on the barn and observe the corn's behavior in their habitat for several days. Clearly, and don't move a muscle, that'll throw the dead off. Clearly, dead. Hi, Fernando, don't worry about the observation stuff. The corn will take their own notes. I really need you to hang about a few dozen new fans that came in. Be a pal and set that up, would you please? Thanks, Bob. Fernando, you twit, don't lift a finger for those paintings. Instead, you use the pen draft a letter for me. Dear Bob, you are a nitwit and an idiot. Quarterly Ted. Quarterly Ted. Second assistant. A peculiar book on how to be an assistant in the workplace whose end appears to be to do as little work as possible. Chapters are how to shred everything and intro into hiding in the office and shifting blame through the intern. A medicine ball. Coffee draw. Um. So I need a medicine ball. Probably goes in here. I don't know what the point of that was, but okay. Hmm. Out of coffee. Hmm. Okay. Can we find any coffee anywhere? Is there any coffee in here? Coffee. 
how about in here? Now, where is something there? That's that. this is that off. I know I gotta pop the... Alright. How do I pop the ball? On the one piece of the puzzle. Oh, what is this? Bought in bowl commissioned in a very where Bob seems to have ordered more statues than can possibly be fit inside the book. Due to this, a statue storage fee is also included. He did indeed get a discount, but the cost is so outlandish in the first place that the missing zero is barely noticeable. Hmm. game system. Alright. So I took care of the plant. I just need to find something to pop that. in the kitchen. The way things go here, who knows. So there must be a way in through back. Ooh, did I read this note? Bob, where's the that idiot Fernando? I told him to refill the coffee trolley with Renka a week ago. If you find him, put him to work and do some yourself, buffoon. Of course I'm dead. I don't see any coffee. I suppose I can't go back here, no. Nothing in here. I really want to fill the coffee trolley. I want that thing to go. I can't still leave. Nope, stuck down here. So everything I need is down here. 
but I don't know where it is. Not in there. Why is there liquid there? Can't go through there. Hmm. I really want to get in there. Oof. There's 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 something in there. It looks like glue. How do I get the glue? I want the glue. Somebody give me glue. Obviously the door is on that side. How you get there is a mystery to me. something in the Fernando layer of stupid stupid is there anything I wow it's got all kinds so that that's a coffee trolley Got a bathroom. That's where the coffee trolley goes. Can I climb this? Checkpoint. Why is there a cat box? in this place is so stupid. Is there a vent? Nothing here. privacy here.
Okay. Oh. Aha! I did it. Alrighty then. Alright, let's explore some more in the next episode. Okay.